So there's actually a really cool story behind today's video. A couple of years ago, I attended the Alan Edmonds Shell Cordovan and Trunk Show in Costa Mesa, California. P.S. If you'd like to see the full video, I left it in the description of this video. Now, for those who don't know what Shell Cordovan and Trunk Shows are, once a year, you're allowed to visit Alan Edmonds and customize your very own shoe in Shell Cordovan, where rare colors and rare models are offered for a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity to own one of your favorites. While I was at the Trunk Show, I took a picture of navy shell strands that I absolutely loved but ended up not getting in favor of another pair, which I came to highly regret in the years to come. Don't get me wrong, I loved the pair I received, but those navy shell strands were just too stunning to forget. Fast forward to a couple of years later in July, where I posted a picture of those exact navy shell strands from my visit on Instagram with the caption, the one shoe I regret not getting. I really thought nothing of it, like most pictures I post, until I was contacted directly by Alan Edmonds and was told that as a surprise they would send me my own pair of shell strands to call my own, since navy shell strands are rare and are not sold regularly in stores at all. Of course, I was completely blown away and the shoes are finally here for me to unbox. I was really honored that Alan Edmonds would even think of me and as always, I mean, they didn't ask me for a review or, or for anything at all. They just literally sent the shoes out of the kindness of their own hearts. So this video is just to wholeheartedly thank Alan Edmonds and to show off this amazing shoe for those who are considering attending this year's Trunk Show November. Hopefully, this video will hold you over until then. Alright, let's get started with the unboxing. So excited. <laughs> Can't even contain myself. I feel like a kid on Christmas. Alright, here we go. One, two, three. <laughs> wow. Unbelievable. I wish you could see the color in, in person. It it is stunning. It's not only blue, it has hints of kind of turquoise hints. It's, it's amazing. Really looks beautiful. I opted for double JR soles. Natural welt. Just can't go wrong with that combo. And they included two individual bags, which I know they don't do normally now, but I'm glad that maybe they've watched my videos and they know that I just love two bags, so. <laughs> wow. Unbelievable. I just can't. I am blown away by these. Truly beautiful, stunning. I'm speechless. I really wish I had the right words to convey how I feel, but I'm so excited. These are just better than I thought. And these look, I've never seen Shell look this shiny out of the box. It's very glossy. It really looks perfect. It really is the only word that I could use to describe it. It looks perfect. Really does. Okay, I know this is weird, but it just smells so, it smells so good. It's like the only thing better than a new car smell is a new shoe smell. And it just smells like it came from the factory. The leather just smells pristine and clean. Completely blown away. I, I don't own any navy blue shell cordovan yet. So you can tell I'm pretty happy. Unbelievable. Maybe you can see the turquoise right there. Maybe you can, maybe you can't. But the broguing's just slightly darker. And then this area right here is a lot lighter and this area here is lighter as well. Looks really beautiful. Wow, everything just looks really, really great. So I'm really happy that everything looks like it's in its proper form and shape. I think navy is one of those colors that when a trunk show rolls around, everyone goes for the browns and the burgundies and the reds. I know I do, but I I just didn't want to spend... When the last trunk show happened, I, I only had enough money for one pair, and I really liked navy shell strands, but I ended up going with the uh, chili shell cordovan fifth streets. They were one of my dream shoes, and I've wanted them for so many years, so it was my only chance, and unfortunately I didn't have uh, the chance to buy these, but... I think I like these better than the Chili Shell Cordovan 5th Streets, if I'm being honest. Unbelievable. Now, if you know me and you've watched this channel before, you'll know that 
Strands are my absolute favorite model that Alan Edmonds makes. They were my first love. I remember when I first got into dress shoes, I was just completely enamored with the walnut strand. And ever since then, I've just loved them. I've looked around from company to company, and to this day, I haven't found a shoe that looks and feels like the, like the Allen Edmonds strand. It's one of my favorite all-time shoes. I think it, you know, even though it's not, it's a lot more casual, walnut strands to me are, the, are what really represent Allen Edmonds. I know Black Park Avenues are more iconic and presidents have worn them, but I think by and large, if you really like Allen Edmonds, you know that walnut strands reign supreme. And this is just such an amazing take on them with navy shell cordovan. Really stunning. I just I hope you can see how shiny it is. I've never seen shell cordovan this shiny. I really haven't. It always just looks a little duller, but this is just the glossiest I've ever seen it. And it looks amazing. It really does. For reference, these are my chili shell cordovan 5th streets. They're kind of like 5th avenues, but they're a boot, an Oxford boot. And it's one of my absolutely favorite styles. When I really got into Allen Edmonds, I found out that they no longer made this boot at that point. So I really had a hunt for calfskin models, but Shell Corvin models were impossible to find. So when the trunk show came around and I found out they were gonna reissue the Fifth Street, I couldn't deny it, had to pick it over Navy Shell strands, but now I have both. But the color's quite beautiful. It's a nice, reddish color. I know it's chilly, but I don't see a lot of brown in it. Maybe some slight hints here and there, but really a ruby red garnet color. Still one of my favorites. I was going to go with Day Night. I'm really happy I didn't now. I'm really happy with the JR. It looks really, really great. Shell Cordovan models come with dovetail heels. That's another giveaway that they're usually shell cordovan if you find them online. I know some are in such bad condition you really can't tell from looking at the sole. But a dovetail heel is usually a giveaway. Not always, but usually. I know some special models. I've, I've found some special models that, were, that weren't shell and they had a dovetail heel. But for the most part, shell cordovan. They put the insignia for Horween here now. It used to be up here. And it would get walked on and you wouldn't be able to see it. So when people went online to look for them secondhand, they couldn't tell. But now it's over here, so it's pretty safe on the sole, for the most part. Now, I know I've mentioned in pretty much every video of every shoe review I've ever done, I like six eyelets better than five. And uh, the Strand is a classic with the six eyelets, very American, and uh, totally love it. I know some vintage Allen Edmonds models actually had seven eyelets, like the old school McGregor, but they don't, I mean, it's been decades since they've made it, but it's a really, really cool look but six eyelets is just fine for me. They come with round laces. I'm going to replace these with flat. You know how much I like flat laces, but everything looks really well made. Nothing off, nothing at all. Really, really nice. All right, let's uh, prepare these and then I'll give you my final thoughts on them. I actually have something really special to show you all. These customized pure brass toe plates were fashioned by my friend Ivan Ramos who has recently begun his own journey to produce unique and one-of-a-kind plates for your favorite shoes. I decided to go with my company logo and they look absolutely fantastic. If you'd like to contact Ivan, I've put his information in the description of this video. Additionally, if you don't know what toe plates are for, I have a dedicated video explaining what they are and their purpose if you're interested. I have left that video in the description as well. Of course, and as always, I had my friend John Farrington at Tim's Shoe Repair install the plates. They've been featured in multiple videos already, but I keep going back because they always do a fantastic job, and John is a good friend of mine. So if you're in the San Diego or Los Angeles area, or pretty much anywhere, you can mail them your shoes. Tim's Shoe Repair in Temecula is absolutely worth the drive. I'll be honest, I always have such a good time driving up to see John and just hanging out and recording as he installs different plates or does resoles for me. So I, I really do highly recommend them. And you could totally visit and ask him questions. John's a really, really cool guy. And I've learned a lot from him, just watching him resole and install different things. It's just really cool to see the other side of what I do, which is the resoling and the actual construction part of the shoe. So watching him do these plates was really, really fun. Uh, they're not in a normal shape like most plates, so they were a tiny bit of a challenge to install, but they look fantastic and John did a great job. Alright, here's the final product. 
I actually hand dyed the edges of mahogany brown shade to add a stark juxtaposition between the navy and the reddish tones that really highlights the beauty of both. I really can't say enough good things about this shoe. It's definitely one of my dream shoes and I'm finally happy to have it. I really want to personally thank Alan Edmonds for sending me this special pair. I'm just really blown away by their excellent customer service. That's one thing about Alan Edmonds that never changes. Thanks to Ivan Ramos for these beautiful plates and John Farrington at Tim's Shoe Repair for installing them. I really hope you enjoy these shoes. Thank you so much for watching this video and for joining me in this unboxing. I'll see you next time.